fishing trip. Now that is ugly. Reggie, to you, that worm is ugly. But to a trout, that worm is a Twinkie. <laughs> We're gonna catch enough trout this weekend to open our own fish market, right? Right. Oh, hi. 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 So, uh, leave anything on the shelves? We went to five stores, three boutiques, and a discount warehouse. We even went to an Army-Navy store. Harriet, tell me you're enlisting. <laughs> so, yeah, honey, why this uh, sudden shopping spree? Oh, we needed to get a few things for our fishing trip. Our fishing trip? Well, yeah, you, you said last night that we were going fishing, didn't you? Well, yes, honey, but apparently you misunderstood. I meant we, us, not we, you. The uh, fishing is for guys. Yeah, Mom. You wouldn't want to go fishing. You'd have to put these slimy worms on your hooks with your bare hands. And you'd have to clean smelly fish with your bare hands. Then you'd have to bathe in the lake in your bare, you know. <laughs> Let's face it, honey. Women just aren't cut out for the outdoor life. Oh, really? I think we need to discuss this further, Ted. Uh, look, honey, I really think... Further, Ted? Look how the veins are standing out on her forehead. <laughs> okay, honey, we'll discuss it first thing in the morning. That's better. <laughs> Women. Women. <laughs> Quiet, guys. We want to get out of here without making a sound. Thought you were going to talk to Mom before we left. I did talk to her. What'd she say? Nothing. She was asleep. <laughs> It's okay. I gave her a note with some flowers. Boy, there's more to fishing than I realized. <laughs> Two more steps to freedom. Walking in our sleep, are we? <laughs> hey, morning, hon. <laughs> we were uh, we were just talking about you. All right, guys. That's right. Right. That's a fact, ma'am. Well, Ted Lawson, what you're doing is sneaky and underhanded. Joan, darling, I'm only thinking of you. We are going to be miles from civilization. What if, God forbid, there was an emergency? You couldn't handle it, hon. You'd go to pieces. I mean, you get upset over a broken fingernail. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Or when you get a run in your stocking. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. <laughs> Joni, it's nothing personal. It's just that uh, guys got to do what uh, guys got to do. Right on. Yeah, baby. <laughs> sure. I understand. You do? Why should I complain? I got flowers. <laughs> Go ahead. Have a good time, macho men. We will. Oh, thanks. Well, thanks, Ann. Uh, love you, Vic. Bye, hon. See you tomorrow night. I love you. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Vicky, would you get me that vase in the refrigerator? Get you that vase in the refrigerator? <laughs> uh, thanks, Vicky. If your father thinks he's gonna get away with this, he's crazy. A gal's gotta do what gal's gotta do. Right, Vicky? Right. What do we got to do? <laughs> You'll see. Greasy spoon and tuna pie. Greasy spoon and tuna pie. Stick a finger in your eye. Ow. <laughs> so we happy campers. Happy campers. <laughs> hey, this looks like a great place right here, huh? Unless you guys want to hike up another mile or two. Oh, this is great. Fine. <laughs> the only thing missing is the golden arch. When do we eat? Guys, first we put up the tent, then we go fishing, and then we eat what we catch. I knew we should have stopped at that food stand at the huh. bottom of the hill. Fellas, I don't eat anywhere where they serve food and bait out the same window. You know what I mean? <laughs> okay, let's get the tent up. Uh, Mr. Larson, are you sure we're doing this right? Reggie, I've done this a hundred times. But how come the door opening's on the top? Yeah, Dad. It's like putting on long underwear in 
and your head goes through the flap. <laughs> Guys, why are we bothering with this tent anyway? I mean, we got sleeping bags, right? Huh? Let's sleep under the stars. Let's commune with nature. <laughs> I think nature just communing back. <laughs> what was that? There it is again. Hey, a pack mule. Boy, some guys know how to go fishing. Right. <laughs> Joan, uh, you're not supposed to be here. Well, tell us. We decided that we wanted to go fishing, too. After all, gals gotta do what gals gotta do. Right on. Yeah, baby. <laughs> Andy, would you unload Sweet Pea now, please? Uh, yes, ma'am. Oh, and put the tent right over there. Where'd you get the mule? Mules are us. <laughs> it was right behind the food and bait stand at the bottom of the mountain. The one you wouldn't let us stop at? You should have. She made us the greatest waffles and pancakes for breakfast. <laughs> guys, guys, listen. That is the coward's way. I mean, we'd rather catch our breakfast, right? Right. Let's go catch a couple of pancakes. <laughs> All unloaded, Mrs. Lawson. I'll be back for you tomorrow at four. Oh, fine. Thanks, Andy. Bye, sweet pea. Bye. <laughs> okay, girls, let's set up the tent. Uh, okay, guys. I guess we gotta help him with that. Come on. Oh, that's all right. We can handle it. I mean, how hard can it be? Well, Joan, it's, it's easy when you know how to Ted, do it, but it could... We can handle it. Oh, they can handle it. Well, this ought to be good. Let's give him some room, guys. Let's... Yeah. <laughs> I wish I had my camera. <laughs> okay, Vicky. <laughs> It's easy when you know how. <laughs> you know, you guys are going to be real comfortable in those. Mr. Lawson, this ground is hard as a rock. And I've got very little padding. <laughs> guys, we are in the great outdoors here. I mean, what do you want? A big soft mattress and fluffy pillows? Yes! <laughs> guys, we are fishermen. All a fisherman needs is his rod, his reel, and some bait. So drop your rolls, grab your poles, and follow me. Better hurry up, girls. You're gonna miss all the good fishing this morning. Oh, don't worry about us. We'll be along. Harriet, will you take these pillows and put them in on the air mattresses? <laughs> pillows? Air mattresses? Of course. This ground's hard as a rock. <laughs> what else have you got in there, Mom? Oh, uh, just the basic necessities. Portable color television with remote control. <laughs> A chaise lounge. What, no beach umbrella? Beach umbrella. I don't believe this. Believe it. <laughs> Isn't this great, guys? Smell that fresh air. I'd rather smell a fresh fish. Yeah, we've been fishing for over an hour. And all I've hooked is my pants. <laughs> Hi, guys. Hi. Hi. How's the fishing? Hey, it's, it's great. It's just great. Have you caught any, Jamie? Well, I fought one for over half an hour. But it got away. It was really a whopper. Sounds like a whopper, all right. <laughs> <laughs> uh, come on, girls. Let's catch some whoppers of our own. How long do we have to wait to catch a fish, Mrs. Lawson? Oh, not long at all. Oh, not long at all. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I got one! So do I. Me too! Oh, well, this is ridiculous. Oh, beginner's luck. Oh. What'd you use for bait? Uh, rigatoni. Rigatoni? This is a short pasta goes great with fish. <laughs> oh, come on, girls. Let's leave some fish in the lake for the guys, huh? Yeah. Let's put these little beauties on ice and we'll go and start lunch. What are we having with the fish, Mrs. Lawson? Oh, nothing fancy at all, Harriet. Just a cheese souffle and a Caesar salad on the side. <laughs> Don't forget the chocolate cake and ice cream. Sounds yummy. Mm. Chocolate cake and ice cream? Well, we were going to have Cherry's Jubilee, but 
After all, we are roughing it. <laughs> Bye! Guys. Guy, guys. Let's not give up, huh? Let's show them how real fishermen do it, okay? Hey, 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 hey! Hey, I got one! I got one here! Oh, look at your poor cool bed, Dad! You got a bed, man! Yeah. Yeah. All right, we're gonna eat! Yeah. Yeah. Okay, bring it up! I got it! I got it! Okay. Yeah. What the heck is that? <laughs> well, it is a fish. <laughs> Some fishermen we are. Yeah. The women caught three fish. And we caught this. <laughs> Listen, guys, so we didn't catch any fish. That doesn't mean we can't eat like kings. What do you mean, Dad? Old Dad is always prepared. What'll it be? Fried chicken or spaghetti and meatballs? I'll take the fried chicken. And I'll take the spaghetti and meatballs. Coming right up. Fried chicken for you, spaghetti and meatballs for you. Gee, King, sure don't you like they used to. <laughs> Dad, I think my fried chicken got run over by a truck. Guys, it's freeze-dried. You just drop it in water and voila, instant lunch. Mr. Lawson, I don't like to eat any food that comes inside of his own barf bag. <laughs> Guys, you're gonna love it. I'll go get some water. Jamie, I can't eat this stuff, and I'm starving. Yeah, me too. Well, I'm going to go see if I can catch some fish in a different spot. Now, while you're at it, I'm going to take a little hike, too. Down to that food and base stand? No, over to Harriet. A little sweet talk from me, and we'll be chowing down on some of her real food. All right. <laughs> Oh, Jamie, this is a wonderful idea to have a picnic alone with you. Now, what's so important you wanted to say to me? Why don't we eat first? Or why don't we talk first? <laughs> okay. Well, Harriet, I've known you for a long time. And I guess I have seemed to... care for you. <laughs> Let's eat. My little lamb chop. Lamb chop. <laughs> you made me so happy, honey bun. Bun! <laughs> we can just see our future together. We'll live in a house with a white picket fence and a puppy. One of those long, thin ones that has a body like a hot dog. Hot dog! <laughs> and we'll have two children. What do you think we should name them, Jamie? Steak and french fries. Different names for children, Jamie. They are if you eat them. <laughs> What's in here, Harriet? Lots of goodies. And you can have them all. Oh, great. As soon as we seal our engagement with a kiss. <laughs> no, no, I can't do it. I'd rather fight squirrels for their nuts. <laughs> I wonder if he said he liked me just for my food. I can live with that. Uh, Vicky, uh, would you toss the salad, please? Toss the salad. <laughs> salad is tossed. Thank you, Vicky. Hi. Oh, hi. Well, we were just preparing lunch. Uh, Vicky, would you cook the fish plates? Cook the fish. <laughs> oh, thank you, Vicky. Boy, this outdoor life is a snap. Well, sure, when you got a robot to do all the work for you. Oh, are you saying that I couldn't handle it without Vicky? If the pantyhose fits, wear it, huh? Really? All right. Um, Vicky, from now on, you're not to use any of your special abilities for the rest of the fishing trip. Got it? Got it. Good. Good. Good luck. <laughs> <laughs> 
Hot shot. <laughs> okay, guys, no more fooling around. We're gonna do some serious fishing. This time, we're gonna go further up the lake. Dad, based on your track record so far, Reggie and I will go further down the lake. <laughs> Good idea. We'll catch them coming and going. <laughs> You having fun? On a scale of one to ten? We haven't stepped on the scale yet. <laughs> We're gonna do some more fishing. My poor Jamie. Still trying to catch a little fish? Are you suggesting that I don't know what I'm doing? If the pantyhose fits, wear it. <laughs> Can I go with you, Jamie? No way. Why should we take you? I have some chocolate cake in here. Good reason. <laughs> Oh, that looks like a good spot over there. Okay, fishies, it's chow time. Come and get it. Nice, juicy worms. <laughs> Why am I getting shorter? <laughs> oh, no, quicksand. Help, help me, Joan. Help, help me, I'm sinking. Help. Hey, what's the matter? Just stay back, stay back. It's all quicksand in here. Here, here, take this, pull me out. Okay, help me, Vicky. <laughs> oh. Oh, listen, uh, Vicky, extend your arm out here and, and pull, pull me out. Mom said I'm not to use any of my special abilities for the rest of this fishing trip. This is an emergency. Tough. <laughs> Can't I read Pope Amber? Uh, no, 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 no. I, I'd have to work on a circuit to take an hour. At your current rate of descent, you have only three minutes. <laughs> Joe, 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 find something to pull me out of tree branch, anything. Oh, move, move. Come on, come on, Mickey. Oh, oh here's something. <laughs> Joan, would you hurry? I'm sinking here. Oh, you know us women. We just go to pieces during emergencies. That was a joke. You're a rock in emergencies. Besides, I, I could break a nail. <laughs> Get a run in her stockings. I knew I had too much insurance. <laughs> Come on, Vicky. Let's go back to camp and try and think of some way to save him. John, don't leave me. Listen, you can have my half of the community property. <laughs> don't go to pieces, Ted. I I'm sure you think of some way to get out of a little quicksand. Huh? Just walk out. <laughs> that is a dirty, rotten trick. See ya, hot shot. <laughs> Dad, we didn't catch anything. Yeah, me neither. Gee, Mr. Lawson, what happened to you? Well, I, uh, I, I, I hooked a big one, and it uh, pulled me into the lake, and then it uh, got away. Sounds like another whopper. <laughs> There you go, guys. Uh, we you are going to stay guys. nice and dry. Well, guys, <laughs> looks like we got the last laugh on them, right? <laughs> I don't think so, Dad. What do you mean? Look! <laughs> some suntan lotion, Harriet? Thanks. How about you, Vicky? No, thanks. We are roughing it. I don't believe this. They catch the fish and we don't. It's pouring rain on us, and the sun is shining on them. How come, Mr. Lawson? I think there's only one explanation, Reg. Yeah? God is a woman. 